The next crew of astronauts heading to the space station, an update on our Artemis 1 mega moon rocket and spacecraft, and celebrating our home planet. A few of the stories to tell you about this week at NASA. On April 18th, the astronauts of our SpaceX Crew-4 mission arrived at our Kennedy Space Center to prepare for their launch to the International Space Station. NASA's Chell Lindgren, Bob Hines, and Jessica Watkins, along with Samantha Cristoforetti of the European Space Agency, are excited about their scientific expedition to the station. We've been training uh, for many, many months, and, uh, and we're starting to, we're seeing all those boxes getting checked off, and uh, it, it's very exciting now to, to have this box checked off. We're here at Kennedy Space Center uh, looking forward to our launch here in the very uh, near future. The mission is the fourth crew rotation flight to the station on a SpaceX Crew Dragon spacecraft as part of NASA's commercial crew program. NASA is reviewing schedules and options to conduct the next wet dress rehearsal test of our Space Launch System or SLS rocket and Orion spacecraft at our Kennedy Space Center in Florida. The agency has decided to roll the Artemis 1 Mega Moon rocket and spacecraft back to the Vehicle Assembly Building to replace a valve and repair a leak, while an off-site supplier of gaseous nitrogen used for the test makes upgrades to their systems. You can follow NASA's Artemis blog for status updates on the test at blogs.nasa.gov Artemis. In celebration of Earth Day, we hosted a free public event at Union Station in Washington, D.C. The three-day event, which kicked off on April 22nd, featured information about NASA science, live demonstrations, and other family-friendly activities. In conjunction with this in-person event, we also hosted Earth Day celebrations online that began with live events on April 22nd. The online activities will continue to be available on demand through May 2nd. This includes some content that is also available in Spanish. Learn more at nasa.gov slash earthday. Our X-59 quiet supersonic experimental aircraft is back at Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works facility in Southern California after months of critical ground tests in Texas. The testing was conducted to ensure the aircraft could withstand the loads and stresses of supersonic flight. The X-59 will now undergo further testing and development as engineers continue making progress toward its first demonstration flights over communities around the U.S. starting in 2024. On April 18th, cosmonauts Oleg Artemyev and Denise Matveyev of Roscosmos completed a 6-hour and 37-minute spacewalk outside the International Space Station. The pair installed and connected a control panel for the 37-foot-long European robotic arm mounted to the Nauka Multipurpose Laboratory module. This was the 249th spacewalk for space station assembly, maintenance, and upgrades. That's what's up this week at NASA. For more on these and other stories, follow us on the web at nasa.gov.